Zim from Zimbabwe, when this announcement uh, made the round, uh, they were saying, particularly those who are aggrieved with the current administration in Zimbabwe, that this is a moral boost for ZANU-PF. And others are saying perhaps the EU, uh, the funders of the institution, are likely to hold their support, the resource that has been given to the Pan-African Parliament. They can withhold it. I mean, we are not going to be told by the people who are giving us money how to think, how to act. Um, if they want to withdraw their money, they can withdraw it. And secondly, this is not Zimbabwe. This is uh, Africa. Uh, we're dealing with continental politics. And when you deal with continental politics, you look beyond uh, the uh, country's politics. Charumbira, amongst all of us here, is the most well-experienced person from our region. He has been with the institution. He knows the in and outs. He knows the weaknesses of the institution. He knows which areas need to be fixed. And uh, uh, we cannot, on the basis of party politics, then overlook the necessary capacity which will take this institution forward. Um, and therefore, for us, was not an issue of ZANU-PF or MDC. Uh, that question is neither here nor there. It's about, as we sit here, which one of us is best suited to take the institution forward? And we found him to be one of the most capacitated leaders uh, who will take us uh, forward. We, we sympathize with those who say ZANU-PF boast and all of that, but for AU, I've got no even concern about EU. I mean EU. If EU wants to withdraw money uh, because it wants to dictate to Africans what to do, that one I, I don't have sympathy. They can take their money. They can actually go to hell with their money. Okay. Thank you. Thank you.